early morning start. <laughs> We're hoping to get some good light as we go climbing in a place called Cape Collinson. Let's yeah. see. It's our first time at Cape Collinson. Huh? So we were hoping for a sunrise, but we're a bit late, but we'll get it on the way. Ah. So it should be fun. It's going to be a nice morning. Yeah. We're going to miss the sunrise. Look at the clouds. Oh, it's so we've got a way to go um, on public transport. It's probably take us about an hour and a bit to get there. So we'll keep you updated on the way when we get to the island. Cape Collinson is the east side of the island, an area called Chaiwan, or past Chaiwan actually. For us in the New Territories, that's far away. advantage of early morning um, wake up and travel there's no traffic there's no congestion no people no, people, no nothing this is very very quiet for Hong Kong We got to M the Chai Wan MTR and then we took a taxi down to here. There's a little parking lot over here, but it took probably about six minutes. So quick to get here. So now we're going to walk down a little bit and then we're going to find the area to the right. I mean, sorry, to the left. And then, yeah, we walk down to the sea and we'll see what we see. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's just gorgeous. What a sunrise. <laughs> this is worth getting up early in the morning. Is it? This is. I mean, look, okay. That's just amazing. I think we need to take a look at that. Wow. So apparently, this is the place where we've got to climb up okay. and over. Okay. You're up. To get to. Oh, Ooh, that's a pipe. Don't stand on the black. Bounce on it. Gorgeous. Fall the baby back off. Okay. Okay, I'll take the. Now we actually should sit here and drink the coffee because. Well, it's okay. Oh no, whose is whose? Oh well. The right side one, I think, was mine. Okay. okay. I was a little bit worried at that point because um, I'm particular about my coffee and so when I do not know whose coffee is whose, uh, okay. yeah, it's, it's, uh, I like weak coffee so I needed to know which one was which. Thanks, sir. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> I have a very particular taste about coffee. It has to be really weak, otherwise it tastes like cigarettes to me. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, it's not great coffee. So this 7-Eleven didn't make nice coffee. Chai one station, avoid. Sorry, tree. <laughs> Still getting used Whoa, to the camera. Oh, come on. 
just, you like? I do. I like. Love Hong Kong. It feels late, but it's super early in the morning. Well, it's half past seven. Who is this? My wife is up early in the morning and she's happy about it. <laughs> Who are you? Well, it feels like I'm traveling, okay? That's why. It's an event. It's an event. This area is called Cape Collinson, as we said before, and um, there used to be British fortifications here during the Second World War, um, which were actually only really damaged and mostly destroyed uh, by the typhoon Mankut in 2018. It was a vicious, vicious typhoon. So which way do we want to go, Heidi? So I think um, it's down here, but let me... Let me make sure. So this is a climbing essential in Hong Kong now. Hong Kong Rock by Francis Hayden. Francis, thank you. This is amazing. So we use this. Where we're going. It's actually not cold, I'm gonna take off my jacket. Um, maybe, maybe we can make this stand. Down here past the bunker is the dawn, the sheltered pebble beach. Yeah. Concrete plus let's take the right fork to the lower bunker and to a level area with a good view of the zone. So it's probably that there. Face and out. To see and continue down towards the water, and located near the mouth of the channel leading into the zone is a series of via ferrata ladders. Okay, we'll okay, okay, cool. Okay, this needs to be in there. It is warming Please. up, isn't it? Lovely. That's liquor. Oh, this is gorgeous. Gorgeous. As the Irish would say. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Okay. Oh, you should hear the, the music we heard in the bus. Crazy. Maybe we can play some. I don't know if YouTube will block it, but we'll try. <laughs> there's a kind of... There's actually... When Josh did his DNA test, they do a DNA, there's a DNA characteristic or co gene that codes for sneezing when the light changes. Yes. I think I have that. Think Autosomal dominant <laughs> compelling helioophthalmic oh, outburst. Nice. Oh, this is huge. Awesome! Oh. <laughs> what a beautiful place. Wait. Down here, Heidi. We'll be down this way. Um, Insta360. You look stupid. I really think <laughs> you need to redesign this head thing. It's um, horrible is the right word. Okay, so Dad's putting on the unicorn mount. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is a unicorn mount. Yeah, stay there. That's a very peculiar protrusion. <laughs> <laughs> now I just have to make it not fall off. <laughs> I can call you Spoonbill. <laughs> Spoon John. <laughs> okay, wait. Start recording. Start recording. Okay, Spoonbill. This is not funny. <laughs> this, is, this is hilarious. I'm messing with my hair. So this is a little via ferrata that you go down and uh, then you walk along the side of the cliff and we were pretty excited to get onto this volcanic tuff because we've been climbing mostly granite and uh, it's quite hard and, and edgy so um, yeah it, it, this was a quite a different style of climbing I think. Um, the rock was a little bit mossy in the, in the front part, you'll see me touching the wall there but um, the rest of it is, is actually quite nice to climb on and 
And this part really is just getting ready and set up and checking each other out and getting the gear on. Not checking each other out. Also. That sounds, yeah, okay, that too. But in any case, so, um, yeah, uh, it's better to fast forward over that, I suppose. Okay, here we go. First climb of the day. Leading first climb is always terrifying. You always go like, why am I here? What the heck's going on? I don't call now because I don't want to catch you. Because you're going to... Okay, this is fine. Cables are so unsafe. This is good. There's lots of good holes here. Uh, I'm going to take the blue. Is there longer? Okay. Okay. You got me. Yep. So, first experience on volcanic tuff. Um, I'm so used to super, super rough granite that just sticks anything. If you can take the pain, it sticks whatever you want. But um, this stuff was also early in the morning. It was still quite damp, and there was quite a lot of seepage mm -hmm. on the roots. So harder than I expected. And this route, I think, is only like a six A or something, um, which I can usually climb in my sleep, but not so much on this day also we didn't really warm up so i got blown out really quickly pumped up really quickly and i had to take a rest but um this place i think has a lot of potential after the first climb the other climbs really picked up and was so much more fun yeah um but um, i'm trying very hard to climb slower also when i climb so. okay <sighs> falling <laughs> Great. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. <laughs> it's good. It's not hard. It's just the holes are quite small, and I'm first. First lead always sucks. Ah. Okay. Let me just take a sec. Is you okay, Dar? Yeah, yeah. Shall I go? Give you some. Take some rope. Yeah. Take more. Okay. It's not that hard, it's just figuring it's just out the figuring out the beta. The beta. What the Americans say. The what? Beta. What is a beta? It's beta in American. Yeah, but why beta? That's what does the, beta mean? Beta means the, the 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 information on how the root works. Oh okay. Right and left. More left and left. <laughs> So during my climb, we um, mounted the camera on my head, uh, but what we found out is actually it bumped, you'll, and you'll see it in the, in the footage, the, the camera lens bumped a lot against the rock, which caused it to scratch immediately, or at least the, the covers that we put on mm -hmm. was scratched immediately. Thankfully, it wasn't directly on the lens, because then, you know, that would have been bye-bye camera. Um, so it wasn't the best angle, it wasn't the best place to put on your head? Yeah, I'm really impressed by the way the camera stabilizes the video. It mm -hmm. looks very cool, but you can't see the person's face in this in this shot. And if you do turn the camera so that you can see the person's face, then it sticks out like a unicorn horn and you, it's really, <laughs> you can't really climb like that. Um, yeah. As you can see here, Heidi, already with the way it is, she's banging Bump. it into the wall all Bump. the time. Bump. quite a few times you can see the marks mm. on the the lens covers which thankfully we had on yeah um, which basically ruined the video for a, a lot of the shots that we wanted um, but at least we had them and um, one of the things also on my earlier climb we were we had the camera mounted on my wrist and i yeah. think that was much more interesting angle mm -hmm. um, but to make it tight enough to not flop around your wrist 
on your lower arm, then it's so tight that it, you pump out almost. It restricts the flow yeah. of blood basically to your <laughs> to your hand. So that's not <laughs> ideal, but I think it works quite well for short shorter shots. Mm. Um, another negative part of the lens covers that we had on there is they they also reflect reflect a lot of light. You can see them in the yeah. sunlight. Yeah. They you know they they create artifacts on the picture. So I'm not very happy about that either. But um, so we'll I think to. generally we'll use the camera without the lens covers, um, but whenever the lens is potentially going to get damaged, we'll get it. I slam into this wall, I know it. Yes, I will. Oh, damn it. Like I said, the second time up, way easier. Mm. The sun had come out a bit and dried up the rock and um, warmed up my hands. Mm. Um, and actually, really pleasant climb, not hard, but just really fun. Yeah. Uh, so I went up again just to clean up the route, take the rope out. The second route uh, we climbed Use Your Groove, also a 6A, it's very easy. For you. But it was wet. The early, the beginning of this route was quite wet and so really tricky. So. Our 360's battery has gone out before we even thought it would, but yeah, Cape Collinson, people climbing, pretty awesome. We're cooling down, so <laughs> yeah, we're repelling down. And we're just doing an easy one to cool down with, and then we're done. <laughs> hey Jan, go on, you can do it. So, what do you think of those people climbing in there? They're climbing this almost off with, off with crack. It's really, really quite big, and there's a lot of jams and stuff. And it looks like they're like you're going into your shoulder. Yeah. I think it's like it looks so in, like it's almost an intimate way to climb. Like you're really getting really up close and personal with the rock. Yeah. Cool. I want to try. Pretty, pretty cool, yeah. It's lovely to see, you know, when someone does it well. Yeah. And you really have to jam, like, jam almost up to your shoulder, your, yeah. your hands in almost, almost up to your shoulder. Really yeah. Is that something we never do? I'd love to learn how to do it. Yeah. Try it. Okay, we're yeah, on our way. Anymore, on our way back now. It was fun, wasn't it? Well. Yeah. And so, just gonna walk up here, which you can't see, I suppose. I don't see it a bit. So, we're walking down to the other side now, which is um, Bunker Hill, sorry, and as you can see, there are a lot more people now this time of day. Well, it's, it's lunch hour, so best time to climb or to come here and want to be alone is uh, yeah, early. So, hands do not have the stability of the 360, but they will walk this way, and you can see. Okay, so if you can't get a taxi or a bus, it's up, 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 stay as we go, and do the MTR. <sighs> 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 
So eventually we had to um, walk back to the MTR. Uh, we got a taxi halfway, but it's it's a nice walk actually. So um, you know, don't yeah, be too worried if nice. you can't get a taxi from there, or don't, you know, don't even have to bother 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 ordering a taxi. It's a nice walk. It's a pleasant mm. walk. Really enjoyable adventure. Love to go back there again and do it. Um, climb some more routes. Um, so we hope you join us again on some more adventure in yeah. Hong Kong. Some more lessons learned. Do we want to talk about that now? Or no? Nah. Okay, stop recording. Stop recording. Stop recording. <laughs>